And we're back for round two for this UEC. It is an auto and Sherrick farm, 152 on the server pop, 73 for the defending CSA versus 79 for the attacking union. These two teams will start out with the CSA already. Looks like we got Jeff Davis battery on Lieutenant Fork with uh, at least two guns, and then we got GLA on the Kulpi with at least one gun. And on the infantry side, we have Williamson leading 3rd Alabama. We got Hogg leading the 8th Florida. And 18th North Carolina led by Todd. Let's see here on the Union for their Artie. Let's see, we've got LFL under Surflix as well as Forbin. On the infantry side here, we've got LFL led by again by Hookah. We've got Anson leading the NYV 6 New York, joined by the 39th New York as well. And we have the GC 20th New York, led by Colonel Vibar. Again, we are live at 40. Uh, this game is War of Rights. It is available on Steam for 30 US dollars. Um, it is a first person shooter. Um, everyone you see here is an individual player. Um, Game is available on Steam for 30 US dollars, as I said. Um, I believe I said uh, this event is UEC. This is actually server um, one um, of the event. Um, it is held. I guess uh, the timer for me might be a little bit off. So they're already moving out. Um, train of thought. Um, yeah, UEC, United European Community event, is held every Friday and Saturday at 8 p.m. GMT. Link to the event is in the description if you want to sign your unit up. I've also left uh, counter battery shots. Not counter battery shots. I left the uh, links in the description to uh, the units as well. Ooh, ooh, this is bad. Never, never, never bring your infantry through the guns. That's why. That's why you don't do it. <laughs> Despite that move, it looks like the main action is going on this side over here with 8th floor and 3rd Alabama moving to intercept this Union attack. I would not hang out on this fence line. This is a death trap. You want to carry the attack forward as quickly as possible. Like, Anson is moving up here. He just took a nice heavy ball. I wouldn't hold the rock. Oh, this is always, I, I always disagree with this. I'd bring the attack forward. Especially against 8th floor and 3rd Alabama. You are not going to outshoot them, in my opinion. Could be wrong, but the LFL is going in for the attack here. At a decent angle. Oh, but they got nailed. But now you want multiple angles. Okay, here comes the NYV. And they're going to come in. You better believe it. Which one of you likes Jefferson Davis? Raise your hand. I, I don't think these guys know who Jefferson Davis is, to be honest with you, brother. So you can see that was a very successful attack, but now we have a floor has come down. GC is still down here shooting, as opposed to coming up and helping with the assault, which could have, in my opinion, maybe knocked off 8th floor or done a lot of damage to him. So, again, you, staying back here, I think, is a mistake here for the Union. For the GC element, I think that was a big mistake. You have the advantage while 18th North Carolina is at a position here, doing these long distance shots here and making a very nice target of themselves for the Union Army. All you're doing is letting them shoot into your side, versus if you come up, you could wipe out 8th Florida. I can see what the Union already is looking at. It's like they're trying to do counter battery. The problem I always have with counter battery is if that's all you're doing, then you, you might as well not be playing. You're really not causing enough damage casualty wise, and you're not really affecting the battlefield. So. At best, you basically zero each other out. Reload. 
à droite de la perdrie, à droite de la perdrie, tous. Also die linke Einheit geht jetzt ein bisschen über den Zaun rüber. Ja, das ist okay, Seite. das sind die Russen und die achte Florida, also das sollte reichen. Take jetzt, wir geben eine große Einheit. Fire! Oh, oh. Ja, ab jetzt ausnahmsweise mal gar nichts getroffen. So we got another forward attack here by the NYB against Third Alabama. Again, going up by themselves though is not going to be enough in my opinion. You got to do what you did with LFL and do a forward attack, and I would say do it with GC as well. What's 18 North Carolina going to do? Send you a strongly worded letter telling you how upset they're about it? Or you can sit here and shoot it out with 3rd Alabama. Let me know which one works better for you. Rearing wieder auf Fünf. 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 As long as you're inflicting enough damage on the CSA. Where the fuck is Dar? Oh, there. Fire! I can't believe the Yardi has not swatted this yet. This is insane to me that Yardi has not blown this up. It is such an easy shot. Right up there. But you guys are doing counter battery. Are we gonna let the mule stay there? And then yeah, I guess stay there. Shit. Decimation down below, boss. Uh, I mean, the CSA is still doing a de you know, Union still doing a decent amount of damage. Is LFL going to try for a maneuver down here that Buka was doing some pathfinding for? Right in front like, of southeast. They got closer to us. Yeah. You see him, huh? Fire in the fire into the wicket white picket fence and defend it fire. Aim low. Fire as well, boys. You can fire through the fence. What's that for? What's that for? Brindley's in front. Oh, but third Alabama's attacking, and as you can see, Brits ordered an immediate attack as soon as he noticed it. He didn't wait. To aid. That's what you need to do. You need to aid your buddy. I said Fritz, I should have said Hog. It's not Fritz, it's Hog who did that. But it is 8th floor. Well, you can see how effective that attack was. And just wiped out a Union regiment. And the other rest of the Union team is just sitting here watching it. It's a nice idea by Elfeld, but again, unsupported doesn't really help you. You know, it doesn't mean everybody's got to go in for that, but everybody's got to make a move somehow. Either to restrain a unit or gain some new position or something. You can't just sit here and do what you were doing if somebody else is going in for an attack. They are still there, Jesus. Yeah. 
Delivered. Good shooting, they're falling back. Looks like 18 North Carolina has been intruded by that gunfire from the NYV. Uh, so far, pace is not going horrible for either side. I'd say it's still anybody's game at the moment. Cease firing! Cease firing! Yes, sir. Mr. Richardson, can you take over the I heard company? I heard it. Yeah. And Union is ahead on tickets. They have knocked the CSA down to engage here at before the 30 minute mark, so that is working fairly well for them. I think standing in this little yard here is really not working for them, to be honest with you. Just getting sucked up and getting all these hits. Again, the, the, the fence is not covered. It doesn't stop bullets. And the Union has capped. That was LFL who capped there. Maybe they're trying to draw out the CSA. Um, they're pretty even on tickets, so I don't think that's a bad idea, to be honest with you. Colonel V-Bar is going to move up a little bit here. It's like 18 North Carolina is going to maneuver back out this side here. Try to get a cap going. Maybe get a better angle on the Union. Williams is, is that Williamson or? That's, that's, uh, Og here. They're very similar size units, so usually I can tell who's who, but. Oh, looks like they're going to get caught out here in the middle, though. Company about face contact. Who's that? NYV. Good little maneuver there by the NYV. Really caught the A's Florida out there. Right now, this little maneuver is working out really well for the Union here. We'll see if the CSA can mount a counterattack here. Again, they've stopped the clock now. You have the fence or you have uh, southwest west? I mean, hands are whoever's on our right. Well, looks like we got a maneuver here. Who is this? Williamson. Let's see what he's thinking of doing. Trying to get around onto the flank of the Union. Coming down this hill here. He does have a bit of an interception, though. LFL is going to come up about the same angle. Bit of a meeting engagement over here. Halt ici, messieurs, gauche, gauche. Arme prête. Bayonnette en avant. Bayonnette en avant. Allez, messieurs, on joue. On joue. Et feu. Oh là là. 
Well, Phil caught Notre Alabama out there a little bit. Byron charge, that's what you want to do. And as you can see, how effective that was. Third Alabama has been knocked back by a nice attack there by the LFL. Very well disciplined there. Um, they they've been better. Left oblique. Right place for the uh, the double march. Like this, like this. Oh, right, move. Auf die Kniescheiben. Take aim. Take aim. Nah, recover. Schnell sein, schnell sein. Arms. Oh. Hey, das ist zu spät. Die waren schon das Licht. Kann drüber schießen. Schießt drüber. Take aim. Left into line. See if Hogg is able to recap here. Union's a little bit out of position, but uh, they coming down here. Make sure they hold it. Yeah, they It's close. All three companies on left side. Left side. Left side. Company brace left. Get on the fence. Keep firing. Third Alabama's dead. They charge you for the gap in the fence. Left oblique, focus no, fire. They're running. Oh, nice attack here. By Colonel Vibar. He's going to push back the uh, 18 North Carolina. And now has the poor 8th Florida surrounded here. And cut off from reinforcement. Now the danger with this is 3rd Alabama is going to come back in and respawn. So you're going to have to make a maneuver here soon. Or you're going to get slammed in the back here. And in fact, I think that's what's going to happen here. We're in a firefight, guys. We're in a firefight. Williamson's about to mark GC here. Yep, there it is. Oh, what happened to those guys? They got killed. They come back. Where are they going to come back from? Should I give them my back like that? Eh, you know. Wasn't a bad idea, but then you stopped. That was the problem. And then you gave you back to the enemy. Great job, keep push. Great job, keep it up. The cold lead. Now again, look how well this attack is going for the Union right now. Even if the CSA recaps now, they're going to be at 29 minutes, and at best halfway down engaged, probably a little bit lower. Ready. Keep on shooting. We will not fall back. I think Union's happy to make this a shootout. Keep in mind, you know, any casualties you kill for the, you know, as the CSA against the Union is really working against you until you cap that point back. Again, Artie should be lighting this up for Union Artie right now. So, not an easy shot, but doable. Watch your side. 18 North Carolina is an easy shot. Same thing for the CSA Artie. They should be lighting up this Union infantry right now. Union's winning this gunfight. They're concentrated. Okay. 
Good man. Du coup, tu peux t'assurer qu'il nous charge pas normalement ça Ouais, c'est pas ah, grave depuis tout à l'heure. I don't know why they're retreating right now. Just stay in fight. You got two more minutes. Yeah, three minutes you had to hold here, and you got to fall back. I don't know why. You were fine. All right, this is inexplicable. I don't know why the Union's banding point right now. So what if you take more casualties? They're gonna, you know, they're behind on tickets. So that just means they get less if they cap it back. LFL should be coming in to help them too. Run to line, on me. Run into line. Independent fire. Run to line. Independent fire. Independent fire. Shoot the ones coming on the left, down the road. Yeah, because she pulled off, you let them concentrate. You know, the Union let the CSA concentrate here and get their manpower back. LFL is still not fully in this fight either. They're fighting these guys over here. These guys don't matter. The guys on the point matter. So this is a poor target selection here by Mr. Hookah. These are the guys you gotta kill. See, now you gotta charge in as opposed to just shooting it out. You could have won the fight by just shooting it out, but because you pulled back, you were forced into this course of action. Still might work for you, but... You see, now the CSA is not charging in to help you. A Florida didn't go in to help. And uh, they were able to defeat the other elements in detail. And because the hog didn't move in. One minute remaining. Just sit here on point. Shoot it out. Again, where's the CSA already lighting this up right now? You were over there. Look at what she could shoot. But I don't know. You guys are up over here for some reason. Baffling. And Union won. It's hard to knock a unit off once they've cap point like that. They were all concentrated. Union almost blew it too, and then 8th floor didn't go in. Um, I know it gets comfortable behind those fences and doing that independent fire, but they got to react. Even if it fails, at least you're all back in Maine and can go in as one big, ma you know, one big mass. It's supposed to be an all disaggregated, but anyway, that's it for the uh, first UEC. Uh, we'll get one more tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. But, uh, good job from the Union team. Stay concentrated. Stay together. See what you can do. It's very hard to beat.